Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Deus Ex. It is time for us to burst forth casually to Osgood and Sons. This is it here. It's now being destroyed, but our contact is here, I believe. Yes, this is the building. It's now being blown up by a chimney echo. And here we are. You doubt? I agreed to see you because we have a mutual enemy. Why a vacant building? I thought the Illuminati were bankers, politicians, Council on Foreign Relations types. <coughs> we always stayed in the background, even when that was true. You all right? <coughs> Caught this damn plague myself. <coughs> anyway, we never had troops like Majestic 12 or freighters full of bioweapons if... <coughs> If what you say is accurate. It's accurate. I just don't know where the freighter would dock. They'll want to hide it. The only facility big enough on the East Coast <coughs> is the advanced submarine facility at the Brooklyn Naval Shipyards. Of course. That's why FEMA took it over. <coughs> They're probably storing the virus in the ship's diesel tanks. The only way to make sure <coughs> it's... The only way to make sure it's destroyed will be to scuttle the ship. Scuttle a super freighter? <coughs> it can be done if you know where to place the charges. <coughs> Smugglers should have explosives that will work. I already have some explosives. I'd pick up some more while I have the chance. But if you think you're equipped, then find your pilot and get going. You sure you're all right? <sighs> I'm hanging in there. If you come across some ambrosia on that ship, however... <laughs> Don't worry. I'll get you some medicine. I'll give you a blueprint of the ship. <clears throat> the X's mark the five trihull wells. <clears throat> Crack those up. <clears throat> Reverse the bilge pumps, and the ship will split open like a banana. Blueprints are very convenient, as well as the skill points. Oh, beautiful. Let us see how many we have. We have a very gorgeous amount. I mean, where are we going to put them? Oh, the decisions that are facing me at this time, it is monumental. Uh, but we could put them in demolition to get extra grenade accuracy. We could put them into low tech to get extra damage on our Bra Dragon's Tooth Blade, which is true proving quite useful. In fact, I'm going to go low tech. Let's upgrade that juicy thing right now. But we still have more skill points. If you've got any suggestions, feel free to suggest them. And I will may listen to them. Incoming transmission. UJ-12 troops converging on your position, GC. I'll land the cop on the roof of the tunnel. Get out of there. Whoop, where are they? Out here they are. God. I need to take cover. God. Oh, God. Come on, shoot straight. There we go. It's a headshot. If I get a headshot, I kill them instantly. Ah! Reload! Okay, bullet shield, bullet shield, heal! Ah, it's, it's defensive. Okay, regen. There we are. Request backup. Looks like we're okay. That's it. I think you got all of them. Thank goodness. Now, get to the shipyard. I'm going to wait till things die down. I think they're dead. Tong told me he found an interesting molecular signature <laughs> on the virus. <coughs> a clue to who developed it. I am certain it was a former member of the Illuminati. The custom <coughs> among our scientists was to sign their work like painters. Interesting. It was a group of conspirators within the Illuminati <coughs> that formed Majestic 12 <coughs> to begin with. I like how the Rykov just ignores all the bodies. It's like, that is not happening on my shift. 
the conspirators were far more ruthless than we were. We couldn't compete. Majestic 12 realized that technology alone could be a source of political power. Interesting, Stan. However, the Illuminati laid the foundation. The multinationals, the global structures Majestic 12 depends upon. <coughs> Majestic 12 inherited a system that took millennia to develop. <sighs> it's true that our organization stretches back to the Order of the Assassins, <coughs> or Hashishim, <coughs> but not in the way you might imagine. Uh oh? <laughs> the Order hasn't so much lasted, has been continually revived. <coughs> Adam Weishaupt started from scratch in Bavaria in 1776. <sighs> but so did Thomas Jefferson a few years later. It's the idea that has lasted. The system. The system? Or the desire. <laughs> Every thinking person's desire to give the world some decent organization. I can go along with that. Cecil Rhodes, for instance. Absolutely no formal connection to the Illuminati at all, but one of the greatest visionaries of centralized power. Now we have Rhodes Scholarships, which feed recruits right into the Council on Foreign Relations, a very powerful tool. In my opinion, the history of the human race has been one long succession of conspiracies. To deceive ourselves, we call the successful conspiracies governments. That's a very interesting point. The successful conspiracies are governments. Everyone else, well, they're just, they're just failed conspiracies, aren't they? And the bots can see me now. Staten's run out of things to say. <gasps> That was pretty interesting. Worthwhile conversation, in my opinion. That's why I happily listened to it. I hope that you enjoyed it. I did. There's another one of those riot cops. We're not willing to see our face injured by his weapon. This is why we have countermeasures to enemy face mirrors. But he didn't notice. That's okay. That's okay, too. I'm going to say another visit to Smuggler. The reason why is to save his life. Yes. Password? Blood. You know why? Because we just received a transmission. What did this transmission say, I hear you ask? It said this. It's actually an objective. See Smuggler for explosives. Gunther Harmon. We are preparing our operation now. You are finished. Even though it's the wrong language, sorry, wrong accent. Notice how the alcohol is immune to the power of nanite weapons. That's just what alcohol does. That's right, alcohol versus weapons. Alcohol wins. Alright, time to frustrate bots again. It's great we keep doing that. Picking up incoming MJ-12 troops. They must have your location. Better get what you need from Smuggler Pronto and meet me on the roof of the hotel. Hi, Smuggler. I need your help. So? I've uncovered the truth about the Grey Death. It's a man-made virus and there's a load of it on a super freighter at the Brooklyn Naval Shipyard. No tall stories. Just tell me what you want. Help me scuttle it. You have any extra lambs or rockets? You think you can scuttle a freighter with a lamb? A few lambs at weld points. I'll help you out. How about a rocket for a GEP gun? Usually save those for the NSF, but I'll sell it at a loss, say 2500 You can also have a half dozen lambs for 2400 Better buy now. I'm selling cheap only because a lot of people could die. Well, I don't have the money. Well, I don't have the money. Forget it. Hey, I'm starting to get nervous about this. What you're about to do is going to turn some heads. I don't want any trouble from the authorities. Actually, UNATCO's planning an operation of some kind. You might want to get out of Hell's Kitchen. Actually, UNATCO's planning an operation of some kind. You might want to get out of Hell's Kitchen after I leave. What kind of operation? A manhunt. For me. 
I don't think you want to get caught in the middle. Thanks for the warning. Come on, let's wrap this up. That's right. That's all I did. It was just there to say, hey, you know, let's not get smuggler killed. Because truth is, we have only three lambs. But we also have a rocket launcher. <laughs> we have 15 rockets. Rockets will be sufficient. And let's face it, Smuggler's one little bot. It's actually a friendly bot anyway. Hi, bot. Hi. Such a cute little bot. Oh, he's angry now. We got too close to the angry bot. Come on, lift, lift, lift. Save me from bot. He was friendly. He was friendly. What did I do? What did I do, bot? Oh, well, we've saved Smuggler, and that's what's important. Because otherwise, the Anatko would have come and said, Hey, bot, have an EMP grenade. And that would have been the end of that. So go and just say hello to Doubt. Doubt. Let's just quickly get to the top of the hotel. Get out of here. And then we'll call it a video. It's been quite a successful little stop in Hong New York. Dead bodies everywhere. When the shipping has been destroyed, I will require you to go to Paris. Yeah. You must find Dow's associate, Morgan Everett. It's interesting this Daedalus character continuing to order us around. But Paris will be our next destination, apparently. Thank you for ignoring us, cop. We're just climbing this ladder. It's a long way, the long way, of course. We lost a bit of bioelectric energy, but otherwise we're fully healed. And ready. Let's go. Let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. Are you ready? Oh. For the glory that will be the Brooklyn Naval Shipyards. Oh, I'm ready. Swinging the charm in the room. <sighs> Happy Kilk. Alright. Brooklyn Naval Shipyards, Submarine Warfare Division. Fair enough. Great in the wall, I am. So I'm gonna just call it a video. You pass the fence. Good. Up ahead above the barracks. You need to gain entry to the base and eventually reach the large building to the north. Keep your eyes open for the ammo storage facility. You need to load up on explosives. That's the thing, we could have spent money or we could just load get explosives here. Let's say hello to this man first, just a couple before we go. You came in on the chopper? You must be with the DC people. That's right. That door's unlocked anyway. My sister lives down there. She works in the Space Museum. Cool. Hi, guys. You must be dead. Who's asking? Our buddy Benny said to expect. Think you can find out what's going on in there? Go for it. Is FEMA really running the show? FEMA and the Chinese? I don't like the smell of it one bit. Me either. This key will open the main gate. The guard just inside the main building entrance will let you pass. But don't expect any hospitality from the FEMA people. Thank you, soldier. Bit of a shame I wasted that lockpick. Oh well. When we come back, there'll be more Deus Ex. Oh! <laughs>